all right hello YouTube it's Richard Ojeda here so today I got a video for you guys uh, the main reason to make this video is just out of curiosity um, so it's about the oil analysis from Blackstone Laboratories so pretty much I don't drive the car too much it's my my 88 Honda Civic LX right there so you know like it's a uh, it's my daily project car but I mean nothing too fancy mostly for looks right now I don't have too much plans for it anyways like I don't really drive too far like I only drive to school to run some errands and all that pretty much 90% of all the driving I do is city driving since I am here in Long Beach California and the bad thing about it is I don't get to fully warm up the oil if you understand me like you have to drive I think it's like 20 miles no not 20 miles like 20 minutes like to on highway or something like that to get the oil fully warmed up to like optimum operating temperature so I mean and I don't drive that far so I mean that's the bad part about my car like I it just uh, puts more wear on my engine so I was just curious to do that and um, let me see what else can I do so yeah so like I'm just gonna show you my oil sample report like I have the paper right here um, the oil I'm using I mean I, I always use full synthetic but right here so these are the this is the oil I'm using the the oil I tested was the down right there the Valvoline high mileage full synthetic with the max life technology so that's the one I'm using because I mean mine is high mileage but I was always curious to see um, because supposedly like if you just use like a normal high mileage uh, full synthetic no uh, take that back just a regular synthetic uh, without high mileage it's supposed to supposedly leaks more so uh, that's what I well, that's what I have in my car right now so uh, so that's what I'm using and I'll probably get another test uh, to see like the main difference I don't think there should be a big difference but besides like the anti-wear additives but other than that uh, that sounds about it I'll show you guys the my results right here all right so these are these are my oil results like right there it says the report date was June 26 2017 and as I'm filming this is July 22nd 2017 so it's about a month already how I said right there, make and model Honda 1.5 liter D15 B2. So it's a four cylinder, has a 92 horsepower. The oil type and grade uh, synthetic 5W30. The it's actually high mileage synthetic, the Max Life, the Valvoli Max Life. 2,000 miles. I don't drive that much. Uh, how I said, I just take it to school and just do some pay my bills and all that. So it says right here, like, comments, uh, I'm not going to read that, but if you want to pause the video and read it for yourself, but some things I do want to point out, it says that that to keep the oil run shorter, I mean, I don't drive that much, so like, I usually um, within the, I say four months, I usually change it, but this, this past oil change, it was more like six months, so it says right there, like, they found oil in the coolant and the oil it's probably from a head gasket I mean it's still the original one after 207,000 miles it says right there uh, the extra iron from spirited driving I didn't mention that on the slip and uh, I do want to point out that like I, I don't just get on the gas when the oil still cold like uh, I mean there are times where I do uh, get the oil to operating temperature and that's when I do uh, do do the spirited driving oil filter is just fine I use the the STP the blue STP oil filter from AutoZone if you know what I'm talking about they're like three or four dollars it says right there TBN is good so like it's still good but um, like I can still run it for longer periods of time but I mean usually within the most I would last I would last with oil six months but it says right there watch for coolant loss and yeah I, I occasionally do have to uh, top off with uh, the pre-stone coolant so right here it says uh, these are my uh, elements in parts per million so 
I highlighted the ones that do stand out the most, which is Iron, which is from Spirited Driving, and like uh, just warm up. Copper, they said it's from the from like brass and bronze parts. Uh, I think from the coolant too. And potassium, coolant, sodium, coolant. Then uh, these are the properties. Self-explanatory. Um, the next oil filter I will be using is this one, the Fram Ultra Synthetic. Uh, this is actually a pretty high quality filter. It's not like the like the cheap Fram oil filters where it's made out of like I don't know what it is, but it looks like paper. But this is the the legit one. It has a um, it's actually heavy compared to the other one. So that's pretty much it. This is my oil report. Uh, you could pause it if you want to take a closer look at it. Alright YouTube, thank you for watching this video. I don't upload very often, but if you want to subscribe, go ahead. Alright, like the video too. Alright, thank you.